Corrie's Todd Grimshaw made a dramatic return to Weatherfield last week, coming face to face with Mum Eileen for the first time in almost three years, looking a wee bit different. She's now played by Hello. Gareth Pierce, who I'm going to be talking to in just a moment. First, though, here is Todd being reunited with his ex, Billy. Have you any idea what you've put someone through? She thought you were dead in a ditch somewhere. Can I see her? No! You can't see her! And what about your mum? She's been going out of her mind. I even hired a PI to try and find you. More fool me. I leave you two to catch up. How long have you been up there? A few days. And what made you come down now? Believe it or not, I'm hearing your voice. Don't bother, Todd. I'm with someone else. Now, are you going to tell me why you are back? Or am I wasting my breath? Oh, it's very dramatic. Gareth Pierce and Daniel Brocklebank, who, of course, play Todd and Billy, join me now. It's lovely to see both of you. It really is. And congratulations, Gareth, for goodness sake. He's back. And I think he's even more devious than ever. Uh, quite possibly, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's, that's, uh, yeah there's, there's lots, lots to come uh, on that front, definitely. But what an amazing job to get during all of this time when it's so, so difficult. When did you get the call? Um, yeah, no, absolutely. It was, it was quite a surprise. You know, like everybody, we were very much in lockdown, uh, homeschooling my, my young daughter. She's four. Um, and, um, yeah, you know, heading out for once a week to do the weekly shop with a mask on. And then suddenly I was heading up to Manchester to screen test. So I'd self-taped before the lockdown. Uh, and to be honest, thought that was probably that. And then, um, yeah, it was sort of July time that it suddenly was back on the radar. And uh, I was I was heading up to um, to screen test, well, with Dan and, and Sue um, and also with Peter Ash that plays Paul. Fantastic. So you were able to do that all socially distancing, of course. And Daniel, I know that you had um, a part to play in this as well, because obviously... It's got to fit in with all of you. You're all going to be working so closely together. Not as close as before all of this, of course, all those social distancing. But you had a, you had a, a part to play in that too, you got to say. It, well, I didn't have a say uh, necessarily, but I was part of the screen testing process, um, as, as Gareth just said, with, with Sue uh, and Peter. Um, because obviously uh, there, there needs to be a connection between, between the characters. Uh, and so I guess you just see. know, don't you? You just sort of know when it when it works, it just clicks, doesn't it? Did you know? Did you all know each other beforehand? Did you work together before? No, no, no we hadn't. Um, uh, but but certainly, yeah, that that connection was was quite instant, really. It's it's a it's a strange thing, chemistry. I think um, you know, Corey, we're absolutely right to ask for that um, extra screen test because. Um, it's a bit like Lego. It really is chemical and you can be the best actors in the world and sometimes it just doesn't click. And I was just so fortunate that instantly with Dan uh, and with Sue, it just felt like we were um, shooting those scenes for real, really. It didn't feel like me trying to get a job. So that's, uh, that, was, that was great. No, that's really good. And that first day, I mean, I know, you know, I keep saying this, but I know it's different because, you know, the set, I mean, they're so good. All of the soaps and, and Corey have been amazing at making sure everybody, you know, cast and crew are all safe. Um, so it's slightly different. But that first day walking onto and see, you know, just being on the street must have been very special. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, no, it was. Um, my first first morning actually um i think 90s era curry is, is is particularly kind of nostalgic for me i associate it with watching it with my mum and my teenage years um so i saw michael lavelle um in the corridor just as i was heading to my um uh to my dressing room and and he said i heard you're very good in your audition um and that was that was just a, a lovely lift actually because you know you're coming in um potentially feeling um, you know, a bit, bit nervous. It's a new job, um, like it would be for anyone. So um, that was really lovely. And also, yes, Sue um, and I, we were, um, we were laughing, uh, probably slightly inappropriately during some bad scenes by the end of that first day. So um, that was fantastic. That was, um, yeah, that was a real great moment in um, breaking the ice and, and, and cementing that mother-son dynamic. So. No, absolutely. I, I know exactly what you mean, because when I was up there one time and I saw Barbara Knox, who plays Rita, and I actually curtsied. Like, I, I couldn't <laughs> help myself. <laughs> I really did, Dad. I kind of just said, oh, my God. It was, like, it was like being in the presence of 
royalty as she <laughs> swept past looking regal and gorgeous and lovely and said hello absolutely gorgeous it's just <laughs> great to have you it's just great to have you back and oh for goodness sake dan we're going to we're going to have some fireworks though with these two aren't we well, I would imagine so. I would imagine so. It is, it is Coronation Street. Um, I, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I, I know a little bit ahead of what's coming up, of course, which I'm very tight-lipped about. Yeah. Um, but um, I think Gareth and I are going to have a lot of fun over the next few months. I'll yeah. bet you are. And of course, we're all building up to 60 years, aren't we? 60 years yeah, of Corrie and there's going to be, I would imagine, I mean, not as big celebrations as, we, as we'd like, but obviously this huge milestone is, is so important and needs to be marked. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, 59 days to go now, is it? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Not long, not long. <laughs> Don't forget, you can watch full episodes of Lorraine on the ITV Hub and all the best clips, compilations and playlists right here on our channel. Just subscribe now and you'll never miss an upload. Click here to watch another video similar to this one or click here to head to our channel's homepage to explore all of our exciting videos.